hi everybody welcome to a new video uh today we're going to show you what to do when they steal your ebay parcel or amazon parcel if you buy parcel from amazon and uh, it get lost somehow it's not always that the parcel got lost but uh, in some countries um, they steal parcels in um, the the courier companies like uh, in this country for in case in ca in this country post office they steal parcels uh, they stole mine and uh, they lie uh, they claim that uh, someone came and uh, took your parcel but uh, anyway they say somebody came with uh, your name and stuff it's because they lie you ask them how uh, they have cameras they will never show you and uh, some parcels maybe they get channeled to other planes and stuff that happens but in my case they stole my channel my parcel uh in post office and uh, also i went to online and i saw some of the clients were claiming that okay my parcel was uh, stolen but when i went and i do that did step abc then the parcel was recovered no it wasn't recovered the parcel the guys who steal them i think sometimes they see if they see someone is gonna complain if you come like me I never complained anything but after months I managed to send a, an email after reading that guy's what um, that guy's uh, comments and I saw that okay this there is something you can do when they steal your parcel so they can cook it out sometimes so now but anyway what I did when they stole my parcel uh, eBay paid me back so they paid me back but now we don't want to leave the the crooks uh, getting away with this all the time so the insurance companies sometimes they pay things uh, and then the company gets a bad name so when the company like post office post office office when I say they steal my pass you can see this keyword <clears throat> so when you come here there is um, this guy's resident tackles theft of parcel from post office in Santin so this guy uh, this guy is the one motivated me to to do the steps he did I wanna see what will happen you can do it on your also on your branch because we want to be able to know uh, we want to be able to uh, not support crime so these guys um, they steal in post office some post offices they steal some they don't steal and also what they do sometimes we, when we send parcel over parcels overseas we do send a lot of parcels overseas uh, you go to this post office remember this is one company um, they charge you this much you go to the next one these thing these post office are, are not like a company we buy they sold uh, franchises stuff like that no so the money should be the same standard rates uh, for the what parcels when you send them so you go to this post office and they charge you this money then you go to another post office in maybe eight kilometers away maybe two kilometers away um, then they charge you different price so they have also that scam uh, but not all of them but then this guy said um, they stole his parcel or then what said then the, the thing reads and they say uh, resident tackles theft of parcel from post office Santin residence brown Brownwood Watson had a, a battle or retrieve her parcel from the office in Santin she was a lady anyway I thought was a man before okay then he said she said my order my older brother sent me an image of a parcel he had posted to me from the United Kingdom weeks past and uh, I received nothing from the post office these guys even they steal stuff without knowing what is inside they just guess maybe somebody said money maybe somebody said what you get me so they just steal things imagine uh, uh, 
this is an image they're stealing an image what are you gonna do with an image of somebody or stuff like that you get me so they steal without knowing what is in the then they just guess maybe there could be something there okay uh watson when he wrote to the head office uh requesting assistance in locating the missing parcel after going through a number of consult consult consultants she finally received a notification that her parcel had been found you get me so this uh um show sure they stole this then after when they saw that the case is gonna be uh sour to them and uh they might be fired at work and all that then they brought it back you get me so this since it was a picture uh there was no way maybe they could sell it or what they just got it back and they give it to her so but look at the steps she did she did send an email to the what watson then wrote to the head office requesting you get me people in the head office they know what is going on here but now uh, we have to help them to do what to uh, claim send whatever so they're gonna try to even when they get those guys they fire them you get me so now we have to write emails to them like me mine was stolen yes i go to post office they tell me look uh your parcel uh was claimed by the guy who has the same name as your uh, as your name and that time i didn't even think of anything much and i said come on these guys after every time when i think my parcel it's not the money which they I bought it. I bought it from eBay, but it's the parcel which I got. Some items are not easy to get in a local market. You buy them overseas, and they take months to come. And then when they reach, somebody steal it. Okay, one step I did. I wrote. If you care much about money, I talked to eBay and I told them I never received a parcel. They refunded me fully. I got my money back. But whenever I think of the item I was buying. Uh, I feel like no these guys they walk away like with something so with my stuff so what I did uh, now after reading this I did the same steps I wrote yesterday but think it was a Sunday uh, I wrote an email to them and I explained I gave the parcel number everything so even I mentioned the what the post office name branch so that they know that there's some things which are going on there so now what I did uh i wanted to do a video for you guys to see what's going on too but i never bought anything from amazon uh, but i've been using ebay on ebay if they steal your stuff and uh, you don't receive it ebay refunds your money back but you have to tell them also in time um then it continues and say when i went to collect my parcel there was a notification that the parcel had been tempered with you can see this since they stole it the parcel has been tempered with sorry about that so you can see that they, they tempered the parcel but now the bad news for them they were it was a they were it was an image so there was no way they could take it anyway even this is a case whereby uh, watson uh, was saved because the parcel was could not benefit them anyway but they tried to temper it to see if this is a valuable item to them it be um it becomes blatantly apparent that some helped themselves to a gift that was meant for me you get me and that gift was not going to make them happy because they could not sell it uh, leaving behind just the photographs the photographs that came with it wow look what they did here a it means the gift was taken then the image the photo was only images were left there you get me so the post office is clearly aware that there is some wrongdoing you can see 
these companies know what is going on but they can't fight the, this without you guys to complain if they steal your stuff even if you're not going to get it back write to the post office or to any company in your country which is uh, where the, th those things happen and uh, go to google search for that company they're gonna give you all the emails take the emails type an email to help the next person to not be uh, affected because you can write they might not get your parcel back or you might get it back but anyway they're gonna start putting a good eye on that branch you get me so I did the same thing I know I might not get it back it's also uh, this happened in March so I'm sure now how many months from now uh, almost seven months you get me but now I know at least somebody else won't be the the main branch or main office is gonna put awareness in that branch and they try to do some investigation some people are gonna be fired you never know but the second person is not going to, the next person is not going to be in the same situation why because now they are away you know something can happen on the branch happening happening people are talking but the main office head office they don't know what's going on so now this is what I do okay then say okay add it to me without mention okay but the parcel was merely handed to me without mention you get me so a lot of things happen this guy this lady she wrote uh, to post office there's a lot of things here this uh, if you want to read this story uh, you can go to uh, I will I think I should put for you this uh, description this uh, 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 description what I should put for you this into the the what the description below I'm gonna put for you this link so now what I did also myself I went to Gmail 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 and uh, dot com and uh, I composed an email uh, I did compose an email yesterday let me show you sent emails uh, okay okay hi okay post office I hope okay I wrote an email hi post office I hope this reaches the right person who would like to who would like the post office to have a good name I put in my the address of the post office where I lost my stuff and also what I did I put in the the number the item number you know the order number of that item you get me so I wrote to them and I told them what is happening but uh, also I received my money back from eBay but I'm trying to like to raise awareness into this post office uh, Bramley you get me it's uh, on 5584 Louis Botha okay service Avenue Grace world Grace world Johannesburg 2019 so that is uh, one of the post office and also the the one we read from it was from Santin maybe your place uh, your post office in your area they do these things please don't just let them do that try to write to uh, to post office and the emails are here uh, you can go here go on Google and say I'm not saying post office only in any country you are any company which where you collect your stuff if they steal your stuff go to the to Google search that company's head office get the emails write to them they're gonna be aware of that and also you might be lucky that they might call you and also you get your what you get your parcel back make it as soon as possible because sometimes those people who steal stuff they they steal it and they wait maybe a month or a week to see or there's no claim on stuff like that okay you go here I say post office uh, head office and you click on head office you get a lot of what uh, a lot of stuff here uh, whereby you click one by one one by one and you can get contact you get me these are contacts for post office you can click here and uh, you get everything you need 
you can see all oh, these are what all oh, these are emails I copy F every email here and I CC all of them so I copy this I copy this I copy this I copy this then I put them in my email then I send them but anyway if you don't receive a parcel at you what if you want your money eBay they are gonna refund you your money Amazon I don't know but eBay I'm 100% sure they refund you your money because when you buy an item they don't give the the guy who sell to you the item or the suppliers uh, until when you say I've got my item but also there is a, a period whereby maybe I think it's a month or two weeks something like that whereby if you don't say anything then they give the they handle the guy the money to the guy so when you don't see when you don't receive any item in that period try to claim in time they're gonna pay you back because on eBay I've been using uh, PayPal and then they did what they did pay me back my money uh, for the item I bought and I didn't receive it guys I think that this information helps thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and please don't let criminals uh, spoil your day and other people's day see you in the next video